Yo, what is going on, everybody? This is RBT, and welcome to the top 10 defensive backs in Madden 19. The overalls got leaked a few months early, and I do want to say, as a disclaimer, I have no idea if these rankings or these ratings are going to change from now until the release of Madden. Some things might be tweaked, but these are the ratings that did get leaked. And also, with them being leaked, not every attribute got leaked with some of the players, but every attribute that did get leaked, I've compiled into this list so I can tell you guys as many ratings as I possibly could for each and every player. So if you guys could like the video, that would be cool. And also, if you could subscribe, that would also be cool because at 200,000 subscribers, we're doing a console giveaway. And if you want a second chance to win a console, all you have to do is follow me on Instagram. A whole separate giveaway once we hit 10,000 followers. So go follow me if you haven't already. Link in the description box below. And also, I shout out somebody every single video. All you have to do is be one of the first 10 people to comment on a video and you have a chance to be shouted out in the next one so yeah i kept this short so you guys stop getting mad at me let's get back into the video now i know i have a lot of questions about why some of the players got left off this top 10 but once again this is all defensive backs so that includes obviously cornerbacks and safeties some of the notable players that did not make the top 10 you have marshawn Lattimore, who is a 90 overall casey hayward's a big one i thought would be a little bit higher but he's a 91 overall Aqib Tlaib, an 89 overall. You have Richard Sherman, which is like with the first year in a long time, he's not top 10. He is 90 overall. Darius Slate at a 91 overall. Marcus Peters, an 87 overall. Anybody else really notable? I mean, you have DRC, 87 overall. Janoris Jenkins, an 88 overall. Another notable one, Malcolm Butler, 87 overall. A lot of those you probably could argue could be in the top 10. But I guess with that said, Tredavious White, another one, 88 overall. Let's get into the top 10. And at number 10, we have a four-way tie, all 92 overalls. So the top 10 does start with a 92 overall. First of all, we have free safety Micah Hyde, who is a 92. Once again, guys, I don't have the attributes for every single player, but I has put together as many as I could. We have 89 men coverage for Micah Hyde and 83 press coverage. Also, at a 92 overall, we have the strong safety Jordan Poyer, 92 overall, 88 man coverage and 80 press coverage. Next, we have another 92 overall, cornerback Patrick Peterson, which some argue, could argue, he could be a little bit higher in overall, but he does have 94 man coverage, 93 press coverage, and 97 jumping. That's pretty good stats for a 92 overall. And last but not least, at the number 10 spot, 92 overall, cornerback Xavier Rhodes with 95 man, 94 press coverage, and 96 jumping. So that's, once again, really good attributes for a 92 overall. Now, moving into number 8. We have cornerback Desmond Trufant with a 93 overall. He has 92 man coverage and 95 press coverage. And man and press are the two ratings that got leaked a lot for a lot of the defensive backs. So you will notice that the cornerbacks have better attributes in this video because it's man and press than the safeties because that's just how it is. Now, at number 7, also at a 93 overall, we have free safety Tyron Matthew who does have 89 man and 87 press. And that is a massive upgrade from last year because Tyron Matthew is an 84 overall Madden 18. So that's almost, an, that is a nine overall upgrade, and that's the biggest upgrade I've seen for any player thus far, which is wild. Now to number six, we have strong safety Malcolm Jenkins with a 94 overall, who does have 90 man coverage and 87 press. Moving into the top five now, at number five at cornerback, we have AJ Bouye at 94 overall with 95 men and 93 press. Now moving into number four, we have Earl Thomas free safety with a 95 overall, and unfortunately, there's no ratings that got leaked for him, but you can only imagine it's pretty freaking good being a 95 overall. Now at number three, we do have Eric Berry, the free safety at a 96 overall with 91 man coverage and 87 press. Now we have a tie at the top two, and at number two, we'll go with Harrison Smith, 97 overall. Once again, there's no attributes that got leaked for him, but once again, you can only imagine they'll be pretty freaking good being a 97 overall, and he is the highest overall safety in Madden 19. Now, at number one, the highest overall cornerback, last one that you, it possibly could be, is the youngster cornerback Jalen Ramsey at a 97 overall with pretty good freaking stats for a corner, 96 man, 98 press, and 97 awareness so boys that does it for the top 10 defensive backs in madden 19 hopefully you guys did enjoy and let me know in the comment section below if you do disagree with any of ea's ratings or any of these players in the top 10 overrated or underrated should they be higher on the list higher overall or maybe be lower on the list as a lower overall 
Tyron Matthew, that's going to be an interesting one to see what people think about that. And let me know if there's anybody that got left out of this top 10 that I mentioned previously that got left off that should be in the top 10. But boys, that is going to do it. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new and turn on the notification bell if you haven't. But I will catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. God bless and peace.